Hey guys, Metal here. Today I'm going to be doing how to defend plane. So, um, to change things up a bit, we're going to be starting with the least viable site on the map, and that is Staff Section Bedroom. So the main issue with this site is that uh, the attackers, especially Glaz, will be able to see everything you do um, and shoot you. Um, now, something you can do to counter this is to put deployable shields in front of the windows, and that will prevent glass from shooting you, but there's not too many spots where you really have space to deploy it. Um, this is a notable one right here. Um, you might also be able to wiggle one into place here or here, but a lot of the times you just won't be able to do much. You could probably also put it here to prevent shooting into this room. Now, if you do, if you happen to be unfortunate enough to get this site, you should be reinforcing that wall to force the attackers through this narrow hallway. And you should be reinforcing the walls over here um, in this hallway. Um, exactly which ones you do, don't matter, just make sure to get all the west ones. Um, and this one you might want to get, but you might really not. You might want to just instead use to get an angle on attackers. Um, your drop downs can be shot out to offer you a quick escape route, but be aware that attackers can sh break um, your roof out from servers and shoot down your head, which is one of the many reasons why this is an also horrible spot to be. That one's under a server. Um, but, yep, also under servers, I think. Yep. Here. Yep, he can break up there. So, that's the... That and then the wing is the main issue that this is a terrible site. Um, it's very, very easy for attackers to surround you, get many angles of fire, and take you out. So I'm going to be seeing you guys at the next site. Okay, now we're at the executive office and meeting room site. So what you should do is you should reinforce these three walls, not the ones with the light there. Um, those lead to the stairs, but the ones that lead to the kitchen, you're going to want to reinforce all of them. Um, these you might want to use to get an angle on the attackers, or you can just hang out towards the back of the building. You don't really need to reinforce these just because they're unnecessary. You're going to want to spend two reinforcements at this wall as well, so people can't blow up that wall. Um, a lot of people miss that one in more public matches, um, but that can work just as well for as a entry point for the attackers. Um, you won't want to reinforce this this side, because um, you'll want to be able to get an angle on the attackers. Right um, you're most likely going to see an A plant, and so I would... You might want to play one person in sight here at A, and you're going to want to play another person in sight here at B, and you're going to want to rip up this wall as well so you can get a crossfire at anyone pushing into this open area. Overall, I mean, that's really all there is to this site. You cannot be shot down from above as the cockpit is up there, not the server rooms, and it's difficult to get a position for Glass to see much of what's going on besides maybe standing right there or out on that lift. It's nowhere near as good as the wing. Now mainly with this site you're just going to want to play to your strengths here there's only two ways the attackers can come from and that's either this way here this through this doorway or through this doorway that's literally the only doors you have to worry about as long as thermite doesn't thermite the kitchen here which you might even want to have a bandit here doing the bandit trick to prevent that um you only have to worry about two choke points and this should be an easy win for you so just focus half your team here and half your team there all right see you guys in the next site Okay guys, we are back at the uh, cargo hold, so mainly what you'll want to reinforce is you'll want to reinforce this whole wall here, so these two and these three. Um, if you want to reinforce other points of red like this wall or this wall, that's fine, you'll have spare reinforcements. Um, those are really only things you need to reinforce as well as your drop down, so that's one right there. Um, that's one here. Right, that's what here now this spot is not as good as meeting room because you have to worry about three entry points plus the drop downs uh, but you do not have to worry about windows at all so that is a slight plus now what's likely to happen is it's going to get planted at b in the back in that back corner of the room to the east or it's going to get planted in this doorway here so that's what you're going to need to focus on you're going to need to focus on covering b and you're going to need to focus on covering this doorway um plain you probably shouldn't have a lurker um because it's so easy to lose the sights um and because it's going to be hard to push back in as a lurker because you'll only have two entry points and the drop down so these the stairs and then the doors over there all right that's the last site and hope you guys find this how to defend episode useful please leave a like if you did if you want to see more of my tips guides how to's gameplays or commentary in the future please subscribe if you want to follow me on facebook or twitter the links are in the description below if you want to chat or game with myself and other fans the official discord is in the description below please do not add me on uplay just join the discord that's the, really the best way to get in touch with me 
Um, and if you really enjoy my content, I would appreciate your support on Patreon. That really helps me commit to doing this full time. Have a great one, everyone.